when you get to the Lakers, the guy that's on the team is already one of probably one of the two or three greatest players of all time by the time you get there. Mm -hmm. He's a five-time already MVP. He wins the MVP the year you get there. That's right. What was your impression of Kareem prior to you getting there, and then what was your impression of Kareem once you got there? He was a guy that I just idolized again and always wanted to – I was dreaming – if I could just pass it to him a couple of times. Right? right. And then this coin flip happened and I end up <laughs> a Laker. <laughs> and I get there and everybody told me, listen, man, he a quiet dude. You know, now here I am. I'm a loud dude with right. a, a big boom box. <laughs> you, know, I, you know, I got, you know, flashlight, right. uh, yeah. DD bone, you know, I'm coming in Parliament fucking down. Yeah, yeah, okay. I, okay. I, 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 I. <laughs> and he was looking at me like, oh, 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 oh. No, 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 no. Cut that damn thing off. I was like, what? Oh, man, I had to be quiet. So, that was our first encounter, you right. know, that training camp. Right. But so I came to him about that second, third day. I said, where you like it? He said, what are you talking about? I said, where you like the ball? He said, I like it up high. I said, what hand you want me to throw it to? He said, young fella, nobody's ever asked me that. I said, what hand you like it? Right or left? So I start throwing it to that right hand where right. he wanted. Right. And he started opening up to me. Right. I was his rookie. Right. So I had to bring him Gatorade every time it was a timeout in practice, Gatorade and water. I had to buy him hot dogs. They had to be beef hot dogs right. every time on the road. Right. I had to go get his hot dog. Okay. But I loved it. Right. I loved it. Now, you gained his trust. Yes. That's, that's what I was working on. Yeah. First game, we down one. I remember this. Three seconds to go. <laughs> We throw it to him at the free throw line. Right. The boy turns, shoots a sky hook, all net. I go running. I had never seen nobody shoot a sky hook from the free throw line. I, you know me. I wear my emotions on my sleeve. Right. I went running. I jumped on him. I'm hugging him, choking him. Damn, that was a good shot. You know? <laughs> yeah. So we get into the locker room, Shannon. He said, come here. <laughs> he got that stern look on his face. Rookie, don't ever do that again. We have 81 more games. We can't be this high after the first game. So the whole locker room looking now. Right. What, what am I going to do? Right. And they tell me, ooh, he got scolded. So I walked away and I came back to him. Listen. Now I'm looking up right. at him, 7-2. <laughs> <laughs> if you hit a shot like that, 81 more times, I'm going to jump in your arms 81 more times. <laughs> That's when they found out I wasn't going to take no stuff. I'm right. going to be me. Right. You're going to have to accept me who I am, just like I accept you for who you are. Right. You know what? So first 20 games, we high five. Duncan, bam, bam, bam. But he, he ain't into that. Right. So about <clears throat> next 20 games, he started looking. So he... Sh he, he came across the lane, and he dunked on somebody. All of a sudden, he came running over to me. <laughs> <laughs> Where my high five? Yeah, okay. Oh, okay. you into it now. You, you bought oh, in. You oh. bought in. I had him then. Right. It's okay to enjoy yourself. It's okay to let, lo right. let go. Right. Man, we took off. Our relationship took off. The team took off. There it was right there. So I love Kareem. Smartest athlete I've ever met in my life. Wow. You know what to do. Hit the subscribe button and become an official member of Club Shay Shay, where we do something before two something.